on our way to Point Lake. Our second day here in Moine. Uh, so today we are visiting a very interesting location. It's called a wine castle. So we'll be drinking some wine or tasting some wine. I'm a bit, bit unsure, but yeah. I think it's going to be beautiful. So yeah, yeah got my drone. So it. hopefully we can take some nice footage. Oh yeah. Keep on driving and driving along the road tonight. As my head of Hilma's back between the trees. <laughs> There. <laughs> Thanks for saving my life. You're a real lifesaver. <laughs> I know. In the heat from a hot California, I forgot how you look like in rain. I swear I never thought it would matter. Unfortunately, we got some very bad news. The wine castle is closed, probably still due to COVID regulations, but they're allowing us to have a quick look, literally less than five minutes, just to come and take a few pictures and uh, actually show you, show you guys what it looks like. I mean, it's beautiful. It's, yeah, so bleak we can't go inside. Yeah, it's so sad. Keep on driving to the bend, still it feels like I pretend. Keep on driving and driving along the road tonight. Beautiful. Wow. Oh, oh this is stunning. Unfortunately, that was a very short glimpse of the beauty of that castle. It's amazing, you guys. So hopefully next time you visit, <laughs> it will be open. Yeah, but it's really a must do. We were driving down the road to the Moine beach to go see if we can possibly go visit the beach this morning. But then on our way here, we actually saw like many little restaurants and um, resorts next to the beach with beautiful views. So we decided we're gonna stop at this resort for a quick coffee or a drink and then we're gonna go back to our resort and go swim because it's, it's hot. It's, so warm. it's not even 12 o'clock and we are sweating. No normal temperature. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, this place is full. It's busy. What? Literally on the water. So cool. What a pool. I'm definitely gonna go swim right now in my clothes. <laughs> This is amazing. Little Go <laughs> get married again. These fish are like two meters big. Do you want to take a swim with him? 
driving down the road we notice all of these thousands of boats on the water so this is called the fisherman's village of Monet we didn't come this morning usually people come early morning to get some fresh seafood but we're quickly going to show you guys what it looks like because the image of all the little boats it's so iconic to Vietnam Race, and now we're on our way to the Red Sand Dunes, which is a tourist attraction here in Moine. It's quite uh, popular. And then, because you always go for sunset, yesterday when we drove past, we saw so many people. You can actually. And getting also... sand, they like sandboarding, getting yeah, like these boards. Yeah, I don't Maybe we'll sandboard. It's not, it's not like professional sandboards, it's like more like a sink plot. What's a sink plot? <laughs> I'll, I'll put the translation here. <laughs> I can't think English now. Anyways, um, well, people go you'll down. You'll see it. Watch, keep watching for like a minute. You'll yeah. see it. <laughs> like, a, like a minute's time. Um, so people sandboard there and you just go for the sunset. It's like a beautiful view. And then tomorrow we'll be visiting the white sand dunes, which is the other main tourist attraction. But this one is specifically for sunset. So yeah, we're aiming for a beautiful sunset. Fifty thousand for one. We bought two. Got the wax as well to put at the bottom. Woo! Let's go Woo! up. That, those sand dunes look untouched, right? I think we should go to that one. I get around despite the loss. I'm over here, gotta get across. There are so many people coming for the sunset. It is quite a workout. <laughs> I agree. And now you made it, but I already played this. Not interested. We made it. Beautiful. We have this is the first one. Good luck, babe. This is quite steep, hey? You don't see it so clearly on the camera, but it's steep. Bye! Yeah, hold on to the green. Put your feet on. Put your feet on. Sit to the back. Sit more to the back. There we go. Put your feet on. Hold on to the green. And go. <laughs> so slow. dinner tonight we're eating at a very popular food court it's called pit stop and it looks absolutely amazing apparently they have different types of food I've just seen like Mexican I think Dutch and 
I see, I'm going to see some ice cream there as well. So. We already had sand for starters. <laughs> yeah, we're so, so we have sand so everywhere. much sand all over us. So now we're here for the main course. Heard each other's feelings on and on. I don't want to change who you are. The things you say is always one step too far. But I know. Ordering from how many different restaurants? Five. Five? <laughs> We're gonna get a wide variety, a big selection, but it looks so good. Okay, let's start ordering. So our drinks have arrived. Cheers. Cheers. And our pizza. This pizza. How amazing does that look? And it smells even better. We're not gonna wait, this is gonna get cold. We're gonna dig in. We're gonna get started. And as the rest of our food arrives, we'll just show you guys. <laughs> so the rest of our food has arrived. We have two, I don't know what kind of sausages. What sausages? Korean sausage, and I think that's like a duck sausage. And then we have like uh, onions and... Um, Mat potatoes and onions. Potatoes. Uh, this is really good. This the pizza is amazing, like hey, amazing. And what? And I'm, I'm a pizza critic. <laughs> what do you call nachos that's not yours? Nacho nachos. Nacho nachos. Here we have some nachos. We haven't tried it yet, but we're gonna try it now. And just for interest sake, that's the same joke that y'all made on our wedding day. It's my favorite joke. <laughs> We had food from five different places, everything was amazing. Yeah. And we, we, we stumbled upon this place by accident. We yeah. can't believe this place was actually like rec recommended, it recommended yeah, on like a go to online or whatever. Trip, trip advice and things like that. But this the best one was definitely the pizza. So you should definitely come and get some pepperoni pizza. It was so good! <laughs> and now we're gonna get some ice cream and we're gonna go to the pier, which is like I think about five kilometers, six, six kilometers know. away from here. I'm just the driver. <laughs> I'm the but Uber. It, lo it looks beautiful. It has like all these lights and like a whole pier area which you can walk in across from the beach. So yeah, it looks very nice. So we're going to do that and then go back to the hotel. And then go get a proper shower to get the sand washed off. <laughs> yeah. We're still full of sand. Good point. My best kept secret is I never loved you quite enough. Just got home, took a shower, and now we're off to bed. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. How did that for you too? Why? So you like the newbie? <laughs> a newbie. <laughs> you yeah. brought a noob. A newbie. So we got to the hotel, took a shower, and now we're gonna get to bed. <laughs> thanks for watching. See you in the next one. <laughs> Bye. I've actually heard when I record now, don't you? I record. No, you don't. I do. Guys, man. Oh, my word. Leave. That's kind of spicy. See you in the next one. Next. I want to know that I'm going to play a game with a transition team for you. The transition team for you. What's the camera? So say, see you guys in the next one. An in, Indian? Yeah, but not in Indian. How come not? YouTube, yeah. See you guys in the next one. Yeah, but it's just so angry. It's so Okay, see you guys in the next one.